Hi, my name is Barry Holland, Director of Product Management for Samsung SmartThings. Today, I'm excited to have the opportunity to share how the SmartThings Energy Service, in combination with Samsung appliances and partner devices, can provide actionable insights to deliver a truly sustainable way to help customers lower their energy bills and reduce their carbon footprint. Let's take a quick look at what will be covered in today's session. I'll start by talking about who Samsung SmartThings is and how sustainability has become one of our top priorities in recent years. Then we will transition to an overview of some of the features and differentiators of SmartThings Energy as a key lever to address climate change in our world, as well as our plan to activate consumers and partner with energy providers around the world. Finally, we will talk about the future of SmartThings Energy as we look to continue to grow our ecosystem of partners and build better together solutions for our customers. It is no secret that Samsung is one of the world's top brands with the number one market share in several device categories, but it's worth pointing out that 71% of US households have at least one Samsung device, and a major reason for that is the trust that we have built in the market. Once we start to discuss customer engagement from an energy perspective, it's important to remember that Samsung is already present in most homes in the US market. In 2021, the EPA recognized Samsung Electronics with a rare Energy Star Corporate Commitment Award. This award cannot be applied for and is only occasionally given when a company's business allows them to achieve award-winning levels of performance across different parts of the Energy Star program. Samsung was the only company in the US to receive this award in 2021. Samsung Electronics was also a sustained excellence winner in 2021 as it demonstrated exceptional Energy Star leadership across multiple components of the program over an eight-year period. These awards were only made possible because sustainability is a top priority for Samsung. And as you can imagine, SmartThings Energy now ties directly back to that corporate mission. SmartThings has been the leading IoT platform for smart homes for more than a decade, establishing its mark as the center for meaningful connected experiences at Samsung. SmartThings creates the ultimate smart home experience with thousands of integrated devices from hundreds of leading brands and now a full lineup of integrated Samsung products, including TVs, appliances, HVAC, and everything in between. There are currently hundreds of millions of people worldwide accessing SmartThings technology on a daily basis to create automations and to control their homes. And since the SmartThings Energy launch in 2021, most of our users are just beginning to discover that they can monitor the energy consumption of the latest Samsung appliances directly from the app on a real-time basis. Put simply, the power of Samsung and SmartThings combined represents an incredible opportunity for our partners. We are currently in the midst of a global energy crisis, where consumers are exposed to energy prices, the likes of which they have never experienced before. In Europe, governments have been forced to step in and provide one-time payments to help customers pay their energy bills. Electric and gas bills in the UK have increased by 50 to 60%, and families are being pushed below the poverty line. In addition, we are witnessing yet another summer that will break all records with respect to temperature, and electrical grids right across the US are being severely tested. As a result, consumers have never been so focused on household energy bills and are grappling with ways to save money and educate themselves. SmartThings Energy provides customers with a complete picture of their consumption and generation, as well as a breakdown of the consumption of every major appliance in the home. In addition, we make it easier for consumers to enroll in demand response programs from 2023 onwards and use simple set and forget automations to help them save real money. For customers, it will provide meaningful insights into monthly bills, but also allow the customer to take action all in one place. And for utilities, it can enhance existing demand response and home energy management programs by providing command and control capability over loads in the home that have never previously participated in either type of program. From the outset of smart meter deployments globally, Single-purpose in-home displays were largely embraced by utilities as the best way to check the box on consumer engagement and provide real-time energy consumption data to their customers. These devices come in various forms, from fridge magnets to the expensive picture frame style with touchscreen, and generally leverage the Zigbee protocol to communicate wirelessly with the smart meter. However, there have now been multiple studies and trials around the world that have shown that consumers consistently lose interest in such single-purpose devices and they ultimately get discarded in the home. In addition, long-term behavioral change is almost never achieved. In contrast, the TV continues to be the centerpiece of most living areas, 
and smartphones have become indispensable for most. This puts Samsung in a really unique position to be able to engage consumers on multiple different Surface devices in the home from an application that they already know and trust. SmartThings provides a mobile native experience that is unlike anything utilities have made available to their consumers previously. Once combined with the Samsung TV in 2023, opportunities to engage and educate customers about their whole home energy profile will increase significantly. When discussing household energy bills, the first question that almost everybody asks is which appliance in my home is costing me the most every month? As such, with respect to consumer education, the holy grail has always been a disaggregated view of household energy consumption, showing customers exactly how much all the major appliances in the home are contributing to their monthly bill. While load disaggregation is not a new concept for utilities, without installing expensive equipment at the circuit breaker, which doesn't scale, the level of accuracy for existing solutions has generally been perceived as suboptimal. Two things have occurred in the last year in the industry that are about to make extremely accurate load disaggregation scale to the masses. Number one, Samsung began shipping connected appliances with built-in Wi-Fi connectivity, as well as a built-in metering module. Hence, SmartThings Energy can communicate directly with these appliances and display the consumption data for each individual appliance. This exists today. Number two, Smart meter vendors have the ability to detect and understand the consumption of all major appliances in the home, irrespective of manufacturer. In fact, they can even detect if that appliance is operating efficiently and identify possible failures in older appliances before they even occur. This all means that utilities and their partners will have the ability to provide unprecedented appliance level insights to their customers in ways that have never been possible before. For example, Imagine being able to understand that your AC unit is eight years old and costing you 40% more than the average AC unit in your neighborhood, and that by upgrading to a new ENERGY STAR rated appliance, you could make a return on your investment in less than X years. This is the type of information customers need to be engaged. And with SmartThings Energy, the customer can not only be educated as to which appliances are consuming the most in their home, but also take real action all in one place through simple automations that the SmartThings platform offers natively. Actionable insights are the key to helping customers save real money and reduce their carbon emissions. The need for effective demand response has never been greater. Our summers are only getting warmer and rising temperatures are stressing the electric grid. As an example, no less than 30 peak demand records have been set already in Texas this last summer, and the grid operator has leaned heavily on demand response in order to avoid rolling blackouts. Demand response is literally keeping the lights on. Utilities right across the nation are under increasing pressure to increase enrollment numbers in current energy efficiency programs, such as demand response, and must find new, more creative ways to increase participation. Utility DR programs have primarily been focused on thermostats to date, and now need to move beyond the thermostat to the next largest electrical loads in the home. This is where Samsung and the SmartThings platform can make a significant contribution by enrolling appliances in the home that have never previously contributed to demand response programs. In addition, Samsung offers a new range of appliances that can participate in a demand response event by running in energy save mode without turning the appliance off. For example, in the case of a dryer, energy save mode would simply extend the duration of the drying cycle but significantly reduce energy consumption. SmartThings has already partnered with multiple DR aggregators and plans to continue to grow that ecosystem of partners. But maybe more importantly, ST Energy plans to simplify the enrollment process greatly for customers to participate in demand response programs and can save significant dollars by enrolling multiple appliances in the home, not just the AC. Historically, utilities have provided customers with a very high level breakdown of their energy bill. But for the vast majority of customers, even if they have a good idea which appliances are running too often, they have no idea how to take action and save money. The SmartThings platform was built from the ground up as a home automation platform and has an industry-leading ecosystem of partners as well as hundreds of millions of global users. Therefore, it is incredibly easy for consumers to set up rules and automations in their home once they understand which appliances are the energy hogs. In addition, if the customer has a time-of-use tariff from their utility, 
Then the app can be used to configure and run appliances only during off-peak times when energy is cheapest. This is exactly the type of behavior that utilities are trying to encourage. So that peak demand, typically from 4 to 8 p.m. when everybody gets home from work, doesn't stress the grid and cause outages. Electric vehicles are the best example of this. ST Energy is already pre-integrated with multiple EV charge equipment providers and will be able to recommend to customers to charge their vehicles during off-peak hours and in fact control the EV charge equipment to do exactly that. Customers can plug in their EV as soon as they get home, but the charge cycle may not commence until 8 or 9 p.m. when energy is cheapest if the customer chooses to onboard their EV charge equipment into the SmartThings platform and control it from there. The same philosophy can be applied to multiple appliances in the home, and as a result, customers can save real dollars. Distributed energy resources have become a major focus for almost every single stakeholder in the energy industry, including the Department of Energy. Electric vehicles, rooftop solar, and energy storage, usually in the form of a large battery, fall under this umbrella and are usually referred to as DERs. As we stand, the grid was not built to support the rising penetration of electric vehicles we are seeing across the nation. That is, in most neighborhoods today, the grid has only got the ability to allow a limited number of EVs to all charge simultaneously since those are incredibly large loads on the grid. Utilities are trying to stay ahead of the game, but they need some help from consumers. Having visibility into where these distributed resources are coming online and potentially being able to influence when exactly all those EVs get plugged into charge is a major focus for utilities. Educating customers about the best time to charge their vehicles and offering them incentives and rebates to do so is a top priority. Since SmartThings Energy has already integrated with some major providers of EV charge equipment and will continue to do so, we are in a great position to help. We can give customers the ability to understand when it's least expensive to charge or when the grid is already on the brink of rolling outages and offer incentives to charge later in the day or overnight. Customers can simply onboard their EV charge equipment with the ST Energy app and SmartThings AI can do the rest. The SmartThings platform is already pre-integrated with nearly every commercially available off-the-shelf smart home product on the market. And since we have turned our focus to energy, we've simply been following the best practices and more importantly, highly scalable process of doing cloud-to-cloud -cloud integrations with our energy partners. While we have already completed integrations with multiple strategic partners in the energy space, Eaton, Wallbox, and QCells to name just a few, we look forward to growing our energy device ecosystem in order to give our customers as much choice as possible. Samsung is almost omnipresent in the home, and we can engage consumers on multiple devices or surfaces in a way that nobody else can. We can provide appliance level insights that most customers currently do not get with their monthly bill, but more importantly, allow customers to take action from inside the same application in order to save money on their monthly bill. Customers will finally be able to see and control everything in the home in a single place. ST Energy can provide a full home energy management system without ever needing to install any additional hardware in the home and provide a frictionless, intuitive, and trusted experience for consumers. Samsung will support its partners in taking joint energy solutions to market across their builder channels. We also continue to develop solutions with security, CEDIA, HVAC, electrical, and solar channels, which are all core in growing the market of net zero homes and IoT solutions. Each partner and channel brings a unique value proposition, and with ST Energy at the core of the offerings, they all help start the journey of a SmartThings user increasing their energy IQ. Where appropriate, Samsung is teaming up with partners for Samsung.com offerings and supporting retail partners to create energy solutions. In conclusion, if you are a smart home device manufacturer that is focused on energy, we would love to hear from you and share with you how easy it is to get works with SmartThings certified. Help us bring real value to customers all over the world who are struggling to pay their energy bills and want to reduce their carbon footprint. And if you're a utility or energy provider, please get in contact as we would be happy to collaborate on a unique experience for your customers and help you break through the customer adoption ceiling. Together, we can make a real impact in communities and households across the nation. Thank you.